What's up guys? Today I'm going to do unboxing some of the things that I ended up copying these past few days. Now, um, I'm also working on a restoration video for a pair of threes that I'm working on. So hopefully I'm going to have the link down below. So I'm going to try to have that video done first. And then I'm going to have this one right after. So for my first package, going to be this. And I think this one is from eBay, but I'm not entirely sure. I ended up buying a bunch of random shoes from different places. Let's see what this one is. Okay, this is kind of weird. See how you did the box? Okay. So here I got those royal blue Air Jordan 5s. Now I cop these for a steal on eBay. Definitely gonna be a shoe. So what, what my plan is to do with this is restore these, clean them up, and then, you know, probably go from there and see what I'm gonna do with these. Yeah, either I'm gonna restore them or use them as donors just because, you know, I don't eat size 10 and a half. That toe box is pretty jacked up. It didn't really look that bad in the photos. I'm actually kind of displeased with that, but yeah, it's pretty bad. But anyways, yeah, these can't just end up being donors. I do need a new donut for a pair of fives anyway, so I guess these just got elected to be a pair of donors. It's nice to get my other package here. It's not like that you put the shoe in an actual bag, actually. A Ziploc bag if you want. So here we got a pair of DMP 6s. This is the original pair that came out in, I believe it was 2006. Pretty sure it was 2006. And the only issue really with these is that the soles are separating. I think they're crumbling. Yeah, the soles are crumbling as well. This is actually a common trend with the back tab breaking, but really not too bad to be honest yeah this is just gonna need a soul swap but it's not not as bad as I thought it would be overall the uppers are actually really good not too much toe toe box creasing bottom sole is pretty good I don't know how they start crumbling already but for some reason that's a common trend for some of these sixes but I'm actually happy I got the lace loss just because Sometimes they don't come with lace locks. And here we got another common issue where the jump in right here is coming apart. And then the back tab here is breaking as well, which I'm not really too mad about. It's going to be a personal pair, so really not too mad about it. And this sole is also crumbling as well. Yep. All right, not too bad, not too bad. So that's for my second pair that I end up copying. to the last pair. Oof, this is from GOAT. It's gonna be something crazy, something nobody would really expect while I'm buying. Get the cutting J's. Yep, a lot of people don't really like these, but LeBron 10s. Definitely a good cop in my opinion. I've been wanting these for a while. I just found one with a really great price. 
seller accepted my uh, offer and I ended up getting one. It's actually not too bad, honestly. No major heel drag or anything like that. I think these are one of the first LeBrons that have fly wire, if I'm not mistaken, I think. Not really sure. Let's see. Size 10, yep, that's not too bad. Pretty satisfied with these. Got LeBron, cutting Jays. Jays. But yeah, um, let me know what you guys think of the pickups I ended up getting. It's a little bit random. Um, the Royal Blue Flies, more than likely, I ended up using those for a uh, donor for shoes that I do need a donor for a pair of fives anyway. So that might be the case what I end up doing with those. Um, but yeah, the LeBrons are mine. And then the Sixes, I'm going to end up looking for a donor for those. Hopefully everybody stays safe. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.